hockey, a game of bounces, inches, and puck luck. All three of those factors were in play when Harvard bounced the Quinnipiac women's ice hockey team in Hamden 3-2 in overtime. Sometimes, the puck has a mind of its own, but tonight, the Bobcats couldn't control the bounces. We bounced back. Um, we didn't start the second period the way we wanted to. Weirdly, we scored, and it's a funny thing about hockey. When you're playing well, sometimes you don't score, and sometimes when you're not playing well, you do. Harvard struck in the first period with Keely Moy chopping a bouncing puck into the net, just sneaking the puck past goalie Abby Ives. Quinnipiac will get their own luck on the power play in the second. Sarah Ev Kutu Godbu gets a rebound off goalie Lindsay Reed, and she just taps the puck past a sophomore netminder. Not even 30 seconds later, Cat Hughes gets a rebound off Ives, another goal from a rebound off a pad in the game, and it won't be the last. In the third, Quinnipiac has had the puck bounce over sticks and off the post. Katie Tabin forces a puck over the line after hitting every player in front of the net, and she forces overtime. In overtime, Andy Bloomer gets a rebound off Ives and wins the game for the Quinnipiac. Head coach Cass Turner says there were good bright spots on the ice. I think there were great periods of the game where we we dominated the play, you know, where we had possession of the puck, we were forcing them to defend and, you know, we got to do a better job getting to the net and getting off the boards and creating more in those moments. The Bobcats take a road trip to the Empire State where they take on RPI on Friday and Union on Saturday. Reporting from the Frank Parati Junior Arena, Connor Althorn, Q30 Sports.